Hey there, it's your favorite son-in-law, Misha, and welcome to Senior Living Last Week. This week we have stories about hugs, chickens and tutus, and a 90-year-old who weaved enough hats to buy herself an iPad to speak virtually with her family. It's a great week for seniors. Today in Senior Living, hug after hug after hug. The residents at the self-help home have gotten their second dose and are hugging their loved ones. Daughters are holding the hands of their mothers, and even a couple married for 67 years got to reunite after a year of the pandemic. Our second story is about seniors, tutus, and a chicken. What? The residents of Bigford Senior Living in Crystal Lake and those at Ignite Medical Resort in McHenry County, with the help of Fox Rehab and the ingenuity of Lisa of the Family Health Network, made more than 30 tutus for the babies at the NICUs of three local hospitals. And as an extra element of fun, they made the tutus while spending time with Darla the mini chicken. Here's some incredible videos. Our final story is about Myrna Presley of Omaha, who got busy while locked up during COVID making hats. David, the activities director at the senior living facility where she lives, helped her sell the hats on her social media. And they were sold and sold out. She created some of the proceeds back to her community and bought an iPad to be able to speak to her loved ones virtually. This video goes out to all the senior living administrators. You make my day with every photo and every video of seniors embracing their loved ones and each other. Thank you. Hit that subscribe button or like this video. Give us some support.